Hello everybody, this is uh, my second generation Nexus 7. Uh, it's a 2013 version, as I said, uh, second generation. Uh, so the problem that I have here with this device is that it no longer charges using the um, USB charge port. And uh, fast forward to right now, it, I took it off actually. I tried to remove it and then buy another one off the eBay. The one that I bought off of eBay didn't quite fit. And there are these little tiny pins in here that were really challenging to put. So I was trying to, to it was a botched um, reinstallation of a piece that didn't quite fit. But anyways, I went ahead and I repurchased this uh, replacement part. This is called the um, the sub board. Sometimes people call it the, the daughter board, but I figured, you know, this one um, has an intact USB charge port and I figured, you know, that this would work. So all I have to do is just, um, you know, buy it and then reinstall it. Unfortunately, when I installed this one, the charge port did work, but the, uh, the touch um, sensor on the screen no longer worked. So I couldn't, um, you know, do anything with it because touch sensor didn't work. So the screen wasn't detecting any touch input. So what I did was um, I figured maybe the ribbon was messed up when I reinstallation, when I reinstalled the two little ribbons that go here. I did it all over again and uh, didn't fix the problem. So I put the original back in and lo and behold, the touch sensor did work. So I found that interesting. I was reading some forums online where people had the same issue. They replaced this part on their Nexus 7 and it didn't fix, well, it fixed the charge issue, but then they couldn't use, um, they couldn't use the touch sensor at all. They couldn't, it was completely dead as far as the touch screen is concerned. Um, so I dug a little bit deeper and I eventually found something out. Very interesting. Hopefully you don't run into this issue, but when they made this subboard, one of the things that I failed to notice was that the revision number on this one, it says 1.4. The revision number on the original is 1.3. So it cannot be a different revision number or else you're going to lose um, the ability to use the touch screen completely. So I've seen other people on the internet with the same issue. And there you have it. If you need to repurchase this part, you need to make sure that you're getting the exact same revision number on this little subboard. And that will help you out. If not, you will have ability to charge, but you're not going to be able to use the touchscreen at all, which makes it completely useless. At this point, for me, what I'm going to do is, instead of going searching the internet for the Revision 1.3, I'm going to opt for the wireless charge at this point. Unfortunately, I will lose ability to connect, you know, via USB port to like a computer or anything else, so that's fine. I can deal with that. So. There you have it. If you're having issues with your charge port on a second generation Nexus 7, be very careful if you're going to order this part. Uh, cheapest I've seen is $68 um, dollars without shipping. So shipping is an addition to that. Um, good luck to everyone.